Hey guys, what is going on? This is Jerry Von Molstar here and welcome back to episode 2 on the Chaos Craft SMP. So, in this episode, wow, wow, the world generates. In this episode, we'll be doing some caving, working on our little house over here, and showing you guys some of these amazing medieval builds, which I am not good at at all. So, first of all, I'll uh, show you guys what I've done off camera. So, I've added a few chests, cleaned out the area a bit, and over here. So we're going to have staircases leading down into the house itself. And this area is just going to be a balcony area. So, uh, not much stuff in the chest, just a bunch of materials that we already have, and I've just chucked in there. So, uh, in the previous episode, what we've done is we've started work on this house. So, uh, I'm just going to quickly come over and show you guys these houses. Uh, these aren't finished yet, but I am sure they will be amazing once they're done. So. I believe this is Fancy's house. Uh, coming inside, we have a look. We have a table over here, some seats, uh, a nice roof over here, some chests, a door over here coming upstairs, and the upstairs. And looks like there will be another layer on top of that. So, pretty amazing house. Um, I am not good at medieval myself, so this is really amazing. Uh, over here, we have one by Alpha. Not yet done, just the framework, but it is looking amazing already, so <laughs> pretty amazing houses. And of course this house by Conman looks really nice already, and inside. So it looks like it's still being worked on, so we're just going to close the door and come outside. So, uh, while off camera, I've actually explored some area, and I've actually found myself another village off in the distance. And also I've brought back some pumpkins and some potatoes from the farm. So we're just gonna quickly in this episode, I'm just going to, uh, so we have coal. I'm just going to head over that direction, show you guys the village, and then we're gonna go do some awesome caving. So, heading over this direction, uh, there's also a snow biome. So I'm going to gather ourselves some snow. So with this snow, we can make ourselves a snow golem farm, and we can gather ourselves lots of snow. So with this snow, uh, we can work on our modern base eventually. So when we do start our modern base, we're going to have a good amount of materials already, which is really nice because snow is a cheap modern material. So I'm just gonna get a bit. We don't need too much because all we're doing is making a few golems. So seems to be more than enough. So we're just gonna chuck that in there. Get ourselves uh, 16 snow blocks, that will do. Uh, we don't really need these. Uh, we can use them chuck at mobs if fun or something for fun. So I'm just gonna have uh, get ourselves some carrots, and we're just gonna head in this direction. I believe it is in this direction. Um, not quite sure. It was uh, a day or so ago. So we're just gonna head over this direction, see what we can find. And once we do find the village, oh, it looks like we found it already. Uh, yep. Hopefully there is a blacksmith, and if there is a blacksmith, we can get ourselves some free stuff. So. I uh, don't seem to see a blacksmith, but there are some pretty amazing mountains over there. Uh, eventually, we may do some projects on there. It looks absolutely amazing. And for our base, we are going to need a big, big mountain. So we're going to do a modern mountain house. So uh, coming up here, there doesn't seem to be a blacksmith, which is very sad. Um, let's have another look. So explore the whole village itself. Uh, here's some carrots and stuff. Uh, there is a flower biome. If we keep going that way, there is a really, really awesome flower biome up in the distance. Alright guys, so the flower biome actually took me some time to find, but as you can see, this biome is amazing. It is covered in flowers, so we're just going to come over here and just show you guys the amazing view. It is covered in flowers. Absolutely amazing. Like, just have a look from over here. This whole area is filled with flowers. Uh -huh. I guess it is called a flower biome for a reason, and looks like we found ourselves a really small ravine. But, man, this area is amazing, so uh, I think I'm just going to come around and show you guys this area. So, we're definitely going to come back here and visit this area sometime again, and get ourselves some flowers. So, at the moment, we don't need any, so I'm not going to gather any. But this area is amazing, like I said, like a million times already. So, I'm pretty sure this is it. I'm going to head back to our base, and I will see you guys in a bit. Alright, so we've made it back home, and just before we prepare to go caving, uh, I'm just going to head back into our house and prepare ourselves some stuff we will need. So, 
We're not going to need all these saplings and stuff, so we can definitely chuck all those in there. We're going to need the coal and the sticks to make some torches for us. Uh, we're going to need the dirt to help us stack up, just in case something happens. Bring ourselves some wood, of course, and some cobblestone to make ourselves some tools if we do need it. Um, so I'm just going to grab 28, I'm pretty sure that's enough. And just before we leave, I'm going to make ourselves a new set of tools. So, uh, going to make ourselves a new pickaxe. Um, we're going to need a new sword, a new shovel, and a new axe. So, new shovel and a new axe. So, that's all good. And just before we use this stuff, uh, we're going to need a furnace or so because just in case we do get uh, some iron and we need an upgrade, uh, we can also use this furnace and cook ourselves some stuff. So here we go, we've got a furnace and a bunch of achievements, so I think we are ready to head out and go caving. So no idea where we're going to cave yet, but on the way to the village over there, we did find some caves. So we're going to head over there and see if those caves are massive. And we're going to need some torches as well. So I'm just going to chuck half of that in there. Grab ourselves 52 torches. That should be enough for now. And we're just going to head over into the forest and find ourselves a cave. So not sure where all the caves went, but they were here a second ago. So I'm going to come around here and looks like we found one. So this one doesn't seem to lead much. All right. So found ourselves a cave and we're just going to head inside. So here's the entrance. Uh, some gravel gonna come down here looks like we found ourselves a spider it's gonna take out the spider and a bunch of zombies which is always nice spam your mouse like crazy and we killed the zombies so heading forward uh see what else we can find some coal and stuff like that and looks like it just leads back around here so uh, here's some iron, so we can quickly take all this iron and we can go smelt ourselves and get ourselves an iron pickaxe. So, getting rid of all this iron, we're just gonna get some iron. Hopefully, we can get some coal, uh, not coal, get some um, diamonds and stuff. So, we can make ourselves some diamond tools and some armor and stuff like that. So, hopefully, we will be decked by the end of the caving session. Uh, looks like our first pickaxe broke. So, lucky we bought another set. Uh, just gonna mine all these out, grab yourself some coal. Coal is always useful when you first start out because you pretty much need coal for everything. And later on, we might not need all this, so we'll just target all the expensive minerals. So, right now, just gonna get all the rest of the coal. It's taking forever. Uh, may speed the caving bit up later on if it gets boring. So, just... alright, guys, so sorry for the amount of cuts. Uh, I realized midway through how boring uh, a mining session actually is. So basically, I've cut out the mining session. Uh, I'm just going to show you guys what I've got. So we've actually got ourselves quite a decent amount of iron, um, a bunch of coal, killed a few witches on the way, and that is pretty much it. So we didn't really get ourselves too much things. Uh, sadly, the caves weren't that good as well. So we didn't really get ourselves too much uh, good stuff, but uh, I'll promise you guys another caving session sometime really soon. So. Uh, we did get ourselves some iron, which is always useful, so we're just going to chuck all our stuff back in here. Uh, with this iron, so we're just going to grab this iron and craft ourselves some... Um, and craft ourselves some iron armor and stuff like that. So I'm just going to chuck all of our iron in there and grab our coal. So here's our coal. Grab our coal and we're just going to chuck that in there. And we're going to get ourselves some brand new tools. So we're going to grab ourselves an iron sword, uh, an iron axe and a iron shovel so got ourselves some iron tools now grab ourselves an iron uh, iron boots and a chest plate which we don't have enough to craft so it's gonna make a helmet for now um, we'll put on this armor grab ourselves some new cool gear and stuff like that and we're just gonna chuck all our junk in here so we don't really need those anymore because we do have better tools so pickaxe uh, shovel at the end and the axe like that so we do got ourselves an upgrade and we're just gonna grab ourselves some more iron and make ourselves some better bits of armor. So, full set of iron armor in just a bit. So, what we're going to do now while all that is smelting, uh, we're gonna mine out the rest of the area and start working on the underground section. So, starting from here, um, I have no idea what I'm doing myself, so we're just gonna mine out the entrance, I guess. Uh, we're gonna have a staircase leading down into the basement area. So. 
mining all this out, uh, going down from here. Uh, not too much to see, so we're just gonna break this bit. And we're gonna have like a little platform over here and the staircase leading down. So, breaking that section and over here, we're gonna mine one more. And it's gonna go down over here, so perfect, perfect staircase. And that's gonna be a balcony and underneath we could have our storage room. So. These are all temporary storages uh, and quick accessible storages. So we're just going to put a torch down over there so you guys can see what's going on. And basically this is what the setup is going to be. Uh, we're going to grab ourselves some stairs. So um, looks like we're going to use oak because oak would look, probably look the best in this situation. Uh, I need to find our logs again. So here are our logs. Uh, crafting table. We're going to craft ourselves some stairs. So using this wood make ourselves 33 stairs that will be good enough and over here so uh, most likely we'll be starting the stairs right there and it's gonna go down by one and go down by another uh, doesn't seem like we need to go down by that much so if we have a look over here looks like we'll do one more so one more over here and here will be our platform so we're gonna have the 4x4 platform over here, uh, break that, put that there, and we can fill this back in. So, we didn't need to break that, but here we did, so we're gonna fill that back in, and we're gonna fill this back in too. So, it looks quite nice, and we're gonna come down here, and we can break that. So, this is where the platform is gonna be, perfect, we've got four planks, uh, we're gonna put that like that. And we're gonna have another set of stairs which lead down here, so perfectly like that and we can have another pillar here and the curved balcony over here so I'm going to do the same on the other side and I will catch you guys in a bit alright guys so I've actually made quite a bit of progress uh, in the last clip but what happened was uh, my Minecraft crashed and because of my recording software it records the game and not the desktop so once Minecraft crashed the program crashed as well so sadly we did lose a lot of footage but what I did in that clip is I've actually mined out this area and marked out one of these storage rooms. So I'm going to go ahead and mark out this storage room. But just before we do that, I'm going to come up and show you guys. So up here, here's the entrance, of course. And when you come inside, uh, you'll be on this balcony area. And in the staircases, we're going to come down the staircase. And this will be the area. So this will be like the main area of our base. Uh, with these storage rooms on the side and remember, keep in mind this is a house not a base I keep saying base but it is a house so that's pretty much all I did in that cut now what we what I'm going to do is I might just uh, put in uh, my what I'm going to do is mark out the other storage room and clean up the area a bit and then we're gonna head outside and I'm going to do a bit of the exterior so we're just going to grow a few trees and stuff like that and that will be pretty much the end of the episode so uh in here we're going to grab ourselves some coal again because we're going to need a bit more torches uh once i find my coal so we only have one stick so we're only going to get one piece of coal and we're going to put this uh, stick and the coal in there grab our torches and we can put some lighting over here so that one's on there and that one's on there this way you guys can better see the area. So, down here, uh, as, I was, as I was explaining, uh, this is the entrance to the um, storage room. Getting a loss of words. Uh, so this is the entrance to the storage room. We're gonna quickly mine this out. It's going to be four wide like that. Uh, one, two, three, four. Possibly two. I'm going to see what I can do and we may change it up a bit. So. By the looks of things, 4 may be a bit too much, so we're just going to make it 2 for now. Uh, so we're going to mine all this out, get rid of all that, and we're going to do a 2 wide storage room. And inside we can make it a bit larger if we want to. So over here, uh, same as the other side, so we're going to have another block here, and this is where the storage room is going to go. So 1, 2, 3, like that, and like that, and we're just going to put these down quickly, and Yep, so this is pretty much uh, where the doors are going to go and what we can do is what I'm going to do is clean up this area a bit and I'll catch you guys in a bit once again. Alright guys, so I have mined out the rest of the area and we have marked out the storage room. So next episode we'll be working on the storage rooms and cleaning up the house. Also, 
the exterior. So I've actually grabbed some bone mill, put some some gravel, and I've bone milled this area. Uh, definitely not the best. We'll be working on some other stuff, growing some more trees, adding some lamps, and hopefully a river which flows across like this and a little bridge leading across. So that is definitely a project for next episode. Also, we may do some more caving because this episode's caving was quite boring and really short and we barely got much. So that's what we'll be doing next episode. Also, be sure to leave any suggestions on what you guys would like to see in the next episode. Maybe caving, collabs with other YouTubers or something like that. So be sure to comment down any suggestions and I will see you guys very soon in another Chaos Craft episode.